I'm not entirely sure how far we are from the end, but I know that we're getting very, very close. Hey everyone, this is GT, another installment of, uh, Kubi yeah, we already, we already happen. heard this. We should make sure we're yeah. Yeah, that's why you'll be unable... Okay, uh, yeah, this is... Okay, maybe this is a point in no return. Um, yeah, previously... I didn't finish my intro, I don't give a shit. Previously, we went through... That was odd. Went through this dungeon, got to the end here, and now we're gonna go in here and find Kubia. If this leads to where I think it leads, then we're right at the end of the game. Where are we? It's as if this is the road to hell. I can hear it. Echoes of the darkness. Deeper than any darkness. The darkness of the human heart. Darkness. What? Darkness. Yeah. Darkness. Kubia. That's our anti-existence. It's been waiting. Waiting for us. Here it comes! Focus the power of the Avatars together. Aseo, we entrust you with our powers. Vido! Alright, as they said, this is the point of no return. Now we're fighting off against Kubia. Yeah, this giant thing. We are now Skate the Third. We have this multi-lock on thingy that we can do with our... Yeah, see, we can do normal shots, but those are pointless. You need to hold this, and then as soon as it turns red... Oh my god! Um, yeah, you need to do that. And make sure that you dodge those little sphere thingies, because those spheres hurt! They hurt a lot! Ah! <laughs> Not getting me! Alright, now we want to do this. You want to dash in close. Look at that damage. 
You can generally only get about three full combos in on him before he uses Ectoplasm to push you back. I don't think Ectoplasm actually deals any damage, it just pushes you back. Alright, now when you see those orbs come in, don't bother charging up an attack unless you got, you know, like your fingers positioned so that... And you cannot charge up your shot and shoot the scythe waves at the same time. Alright, so that's over, right? Nope! We gotta do it two or three more times. If you thought this was hard, could be a... Well... Obviously, it's a final boss. It's gonna have more than one form. I mean, if you don't expect that, then, well... Then obviously you don't know much about RPGs or JRPGs. Oh crap, crap, crap! Ah! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's get in. Ah, wait, did that slash actually hit? <laughs> I, I, I fired a slash and then I went back. No. Oh. I shouldn't have done that. Because <laughs> this is going to make this take longer. And believe me, you want to make sure you take as little damage as possible. Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> I locked on to him, fired at him, and then dashed forward. So this is actually kind of cool. Oh, um, yeah, there's those thingies that come up too. Just make sure that you lock on and keep shooting them. I, I personally recommend holding the controller, so like, right now my index finger is on square, and my middle finger is on circle. Oh god! That way I can, uh, I, I can charge this up and dash around at the same time, which is very, very important. Let's slash! Let's move in closer! We can't move it any closer! Yes! It is one thing they'll keep saying, it's endless! And oh no, no! Uh, nope, not getting me! And that should just about do it! Just keep smacking at it. Yes! Oh, that was close. And are we done yet? Nope. It's like he's yawning. It's like Oh crap, these thingies. These little worm thingies. Try to slash them if you can. Otherwise, just dodge. And if they come close, smack them around. It's endless. Yeah, like this, they're coming close, so let's just smack them around a bit. Yeah! That's how to do it. No! No! The spheres! The dark orbs! We're almost beat Kubia Alpha. We're really close. Almost got it. Let's get that last hit off. Yeah, you can just barely get in three combos. You gotta be fast. Just mash that, that X button. Let's make sure we dodge so that those things don't hit us, because if those things hit us, we're gonna have a bad time. And generally, it seems like in order to stun Kubia, you just gotta get a whole bunch of shots off on him at once. It doesn't really... It's not a matter of how many you get off on him, just as long as you get a bunch off at once. Oh. My. God. That totally looks like the one... Uh face plate thingy to the steam bike. Okay, fortunately, they restore our health. Um, I'm not entirely familiar with this fight, but this fight is a lot harder. 
Yeah. Yeah, it could be a beta. Um, yeah, he's gonna do that if you... I mean, you want to get in close to deal more damage. But at the same time, I mean, he's gonna damage you anyway. It's worth it, though, because you kill him faster. Oh, crap. Watch out for these. Ah! Ah! Wait, what? All right, there we go. Believe me, it, it, it gets harder. Right now, he's just spamming Gamora, but that's not all that Kubia does. Kubia does more than just this. Trust me. And when Kubia does more than just this, it becomes a huge pain in the ass. Also, am I the only one that thinks Kubia looks a little bit like Summon Skull? Just a little bit. Except that it doesn't have pitiful 1,200 defense points. Alright, no, no, no! Oh my god, that was wonderful timing. Okay, so I guess he knocks you away no matter what, even if you get far away. The Gamoras, they're endless! If only I got experience for this! This move, Jihad. Oh! Um, yeah, that, that hurts. I believe he also has, like, uh, Jehenna? He's saying, Durk Allah, Muhammad Jihad Allah, Durk Allah, Durk Allah, Muhammad Jihad, Muhammad Jihad! Yeah, this move right here, Chaos Jehenna. Um, yeah, this, I don't know overly well how to deal with this. Just try rapidly shooting. Not here and not now. <laughs> um, yeah, that's the only way I know how to deal with that. And even then, I still get hit. Yeah! So, uh, Koopy is just gonna do this. This guy. Actually, you can just do this. Just make sure you back up during it. Because otherwise, after you finish one combo, Gamoras are going to hit you. So, don't listen to what I said. The rapid attacking, it is useless. Yay! Dash in! Let's slash it around! Smack it! By the way, I'm pretty sure um, Kubia revives. You know, like, how the alphas, you had to kill, like, four of them? Yeah, um, I'm pretty sure you have to kill this guy twice. That's what also makes this fight very difficult. Ah, damn it. Alright, we got this. Oh, yes, 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 he's done! Come on! got this. Protect break. Oh, sweet. I'm actually, you know what? I'm actually going to show off this data drain. Data drain doesn't affect him? Damn it! How are we supposed to beat him? He should have some kind of core. And if we're able to break it... So where is this core? Most likely, it's inside Kubia. So all we need to do is jump inside it.
are we? Are we all inside that monster? Haseo, look! <gasps> what is it? That's Kubia Center, the Kubia Core. What? This is bad. What's wrong? It would appear Kubia's revival has caused a gigantic strain on the network. It's only a matter of time before this causes the next catastrophic network crisis. No! Isn't there any way to avoid that? No, just stopping its source. And we've just gotta beat it! Only if we're prepared to be destroyed ourselves. Ugh. It's something we can't ignore if Epitaph users and anti-existence collide. Is that all we've got? Damn it! What are we gonna do? We don't have any choice. Even now, the real world is... We've got to do it. <gasps> What's that? I am the one who remains asleep. I have no power to decide the future of the world. The ones who will decide what to make of this world. Are you players of the game? It is for people to decide. All I can do is connect thoughts to one another. Now, reach out and touch them. Touch the feelings of those who share your inner thoughts. Little children of Morgana. May you find happiness. Alright. The slight sphere, we save, load, access, item storage. Um, yeah, what they're saying is very true. Because coming up are three kind of mini-bosses. Oh, um, yeah, this way. The th uh, the why won't the camera go up any farther, damn it? And the thing with these bosses... Well, you'll see. You don't want to... You want to start with inviting people that you're not going to be using in in the final fight. And just yeah. Just make sure you don't just don't take the people that you're going to be taking to the final fight. Yeah, so I'm just going to save over this data right here. And that there, I was telling you that was the final, that's the final uh, avatar fight in the game. After this, these few mini-bosses, we have the final boss. And then that's it. Then we're done. Well, and then there's, you know, post-game stuff, but I think at that point I may actually get back to Galaxy 2, because I still got to record those green stars. So, this has been GT. Thank you all for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day.